I'm 61 years old. I, uh, I'm an artist and an actor. A new world growing old in America. I don't know how else to explain it. It's not the growing old in America that I saw as a kid. Growing old in America today isn't something to dread. I mean, with the technologies we have, it's, it's man, you can enjoy every single day. And that's exactly what I plan on doing until they're throwing dirt on me. In Detroit, we have a, a saying that say, in Detroit, we hustle harder, or Detroit against everybody. In my lifetime, I've probably had to reinvent myself three or four times. My old man, he was a great welder, so he taught me how to weld when I was 11. Got a job in manufacturing. I couldn't picture myself being my age, standing there at a machine producing parts. My brother, Noel, he, uh, he asked me how my artwork was going, and I told him, I said, well, I really hadn't done anything. And then he explained to me some of the things he was doing with comic books and, and, and online digital art. And, it, and it, it sounded amazing. Um, I didn't, for whatever reason, it didn't click in my head that, uh, that I could do it. But then one day he sent me an email. And in that email, he had attached just a pencil drawing of a zombie. And in the word bubble for the zombie, it said, ink me. And I still have this framed sitting right next to my desk. I inked it and it was, it was like, man, I'll, uh, somebody flipped the light because instantly I wanted to create again. I just wanted to, I had all these ideas that were in the back of my mind that introduced me to Yahoo groups where there were like other comic book artists and other artistic people that you could talk to about stuff like this now. My first computer to get online was an Atari computer that was tape driven. As technology would advance, I was able to, uh, to now draw my pictures and then in real time scan them in through a, a digital scanner, get it on my computer screen. I bought a, a copy of uh, Photoshop 7. I still use it today. I was able to take my comic books from drawing a word bubble, lettering it. So the, the art of creating a comic book went from, for me, months to I could do a 20 page book in like two weeks. And then I had mentioned that I'm an actor too, so this, uh, this love for the arts, for, for, the, for the drawing and for, and for the stuff that I do digitally now that was so old fashioned with a pencil. It's kind of funny when I was a kid, we would draw this stuff out, we, just a number two pencil and whatever kind of paper we could find. Uh, a lot of times it was the back of a, a grocery sack, a brown paper sack, which is the back of that we're drawing pictures. Um, gone from that to be able to, I hope, draw things digitally. My Christmas present to myself was uh, an iPad and a drawing pad so that I can eventually go from so much of the paraphernalia that I love. I mean, I, I love the old school stuff, but to be able to take just an iPad and a drawing pad to like a film set with me so that my downtime I can just create. That's like my dream. So I gotta learn how to use it yet, but I'm really looking forward to that. As I, uh, as I get older, it's like, it's like wow, I, I can't wait for what's next.